Liberty hosted number 12 Florida in lacrosse Wednesday afternoon. It marked the first time in Liberty Athletics history that Florida had a team visit Lynchburg in NCAA Division I sport. Liberty scored the first goal of the day. Mackenzie Lehman had the Flames out in front, one of her two on the afternoon. The Gators responded with three in a row, including the team's leading scorer, Pavanelli, tying it at one. Later, Lepinto setting up Ashley Gonzalez. Lepinto, a freshman, had four goals and five assists for a career-high nine points for the Gators. There's one of her goals on the afternoon as Florida built an 8-4 lead at halftime. Gonzalez picking up a goal as well. She had two for the afternoon. In the third quarter, Florida had all three goals of the frame, including Maggie Hall. That was her first of what became a hat trick for Hall. Pavanelli earned a hat trick with that goal right there. Bayerga scored her lone goal in the second half for the Flames. Lepinto capping off her career day, setting up Sarah Mackey. That was her first career goal for the Gators. It all added up to a 14-6 win for Florida. Shots were even throughout the day. Florida had the edge in shots on goal, 20 to 17. Turnovers nearly even. Within that, Liberty caused 18 turnovers. Caused turnovers, a stat tracked by the NCAA where Liberty leads the country right now. They have done that in two of the last three full seasons and are best in the nation once again, having 18 caused turnovers this afternoon. Liberty hits the road for a big swing out to the West Coast, and we'll be back later this month as the Flames fall today by eight.